AFTV troops, um, you starting to get worried? Zar is. Zar I ain't asked Zar, I'm asking you. Nah, I'm telling you, Zar shitting himself. Zar was panicking from City in the FA Cup. I wasn't panicking. Seven changes, you get me. Everton, I think we were piss poor. I think they were the better team. Sean Dyche FC, new manager bounce. Today, today I would have changed the lineup a bit. I was calling for Tierney. I was saying that we don't need the inverted thing today. Martinelli suffering because he's just there by, the, by himself on the left-hand side. Jachenko's coming in. Partey's first fourth turn. Pop Saka. Martinelli's getting no support, bro. Tini will support him. Tini, he's going to invert, but he's not going to invert as much as Zinchenko. Mm. He's a natural left back. He's going to hold the line. That's what we need. You understand? People are saying drop Martinelli. It's not a drop Martinelli thing. It's a, we need to adapt to get him back into the game. He's mm. one of our fucking, he's, he's our main winger, bro. What's man on? Not our main winger, but our main front three. Mm. You understand? When Jesus is here, I'm not sending shots at Eddie now, yeah? So all the Eddie supporters in Eddie Defence League, go back in your blood clot yard, yeah? Because I'm talking the realists now, yeah? With Jesus in the team, it benefits Martinelli because he's not an out and out striker. He'll go right, he'll go left, he'll come into the nine, the false nine, he'll go into the, into the ten, he'll drift around. Eddie's yeah. just there in the centre. Black Francis Jeffers, he's just there, bro. He's not going to drift nowhere, blood. Do you understand? He don't have that in his game. You get me? So Martinelli is suffering from that now. You understand? Zinchenko, he needs to do more. You need to go down the flag. It's not every minute you come in the fucking midfield. You're a left back. You're not a centre midfielder. Yeah? Support your fucking winger. No, it's been working you. though. It's not it's working now, working. blood. It's yeah. not working now, Robbie, bro. Last three games, bro. It's not working. I'm not getting angry, but I'm saying that like Zinchenko was poor today. Martinelli should have come off. Tini should have come on. And Zinchenko should have gone off. Trossard was a rat. I wasn't like, I'm not happy. I'm happy with Trossard. Happy he came on. Mm. But I don't think Martinelli should have come off. Mm. You understand? But Odegaard we, we, was piss poor. Yeah, with all that, we unlocked them. We unlocked them. We go yeah, a goal we were up. lucky to unlock them. They could have had two goals yeah. in the first half. They, they would feel disappointed leaving that ground today with a draw. Mm. We're lucky to leave with a draw. We created two chances. That, that was decent chances. The Martinelli volley, when Xhaka put it back from in the first half, and the goal. There was fuck all. Mm. Do you understand? What I'm saying we're is very, we're very true, predictable now. True, but with despite all that, yeah. we've gone one nil up. We've yeah, unlocked yeah. it, right? Yeah. But I, I, it didn't look like we'd score. Yeah. We've unlocked it. We've scored a, a really good goal. Yeah. Was you really disappointed with the defending? I was fuming, bro. The, I thought I, I didn't think it was an offside. I thought there was a foul. But then when I've seen it again, there's not a foul. You understand? I think Rams don't need to look at himself. You understand? He's kind of flapped at it. The defending as well. You understand? Yeah, because there was many opportunities. There was to get a whole heap of it. chances. It dropped, it bounced, it dropped. Yeah. Like even before the goal dropped, yeah, I'm saying to my, I'm, I was with Bordy, and I'm saying to him, bro, Zinchenko, the silver's all over him, and Tony's dropping. Make someone go and back it, cause it's two on one. Yeah. Where did the ball go to Zinchenko? Then it went in. It's fucking bouncing. Man, I just did. <laughs> mm. Fucking clear the ball, blood. Do you understand? Like it's, it pissed me off today, bro. Mm. You understand? It was a frustrating afternoon. It was very frustrating because if you want to win the league, you have to win your home games, especially against Brentford. No disrespect. Well, they, you they, have listen, to be. They no, beat, no, they Robbie, beat, they no. beat City. I don't give a shit who they beat, bro. If you're trying no, to you win, see, you can't no, no, no. say especially bro, against Brentford. No, then. because bro, we, went, we went to their ground and slapped them three 0 That was that was way back then. Yeah, three 0 bro. Slap them. Things and have they changed had their since whole then. Team. No, but we need to be adapting. It's too predictable. It's the same style of play. There needs to be more in our game. Mm. Do you understand? Would he, you make any changes for Wednesday? You see, this is me now. I would have played Tierney today, but I'd go with Zinchenko on Wednesday. Right. Do you understand? Because he understands City, he knows their threats, he knows how to deal with them. Do you understand? And they won't play like this, will they? You feel me? It's going to be a more open game. Mm. You get me? It's going to more suit a Zinchenko. Today, mm. we missed a trick. You get me? Because now we're begging for Emery to do the good evening thing. <laughs> <laughs> can, we, can we still win this? Can we still go all the way? I've never said that we can't win it, but I've never said that we can win it. I've never gone. So what you're saying? <laughs> I'm saying we're in the race. You get me? We need to tighten up and we need to find other ways to break down teams. You get me? Because Zaz was saying to me, the low block thing, rare, tear, tear. I was saying, nah, I'm deflecting it. Like, nah, we're good, we're good. Mm. It was only Newcastle. But then when I've looked at it again, I'm like, there's a couple of times where we got, we got a bit lucky and got the wins over the line. Today, we never got lucky. You understand? Today, we deserve to lose today. You understand? People could actually say this is a point gained. I'm being real. Like, because Brentford should have won that game. Do you understand? There was no intensity. It was half-hearted. Odegaard, you're the captain. Where the fuck you been for the last two games? Are you still in Everton? M6 business. Mm. I was saying it. M6. Man got stuck on the... M6. Bro, we was on the M6 until the 55th minute. The man was saying they're in the changing room. Them niggas never left ever. Them niggas never left Liverpool, bro. It was not good enough. Do you understand? Because now City, they got, ever, they got, they got Villa. That's a home game. You know they're probably going to win that. 
we're going into that game, the biggest game of the season, the biggest game for the last 15 years, on piss poor form. No, no real confidence. You get me? That's why I was saying that today, maybe put in a Tierney, take out a Zinchenko, get Martinelli a goal, because you could see he wants to go, you understand? But with Zinchenko, it's not really what that it works with Zinchenko. But for it to work on the left, Jesus has to be there as well. Because it's a whole trickle effect. You understand? Everyone's going to the right. Listen to Beyonce. To the left, to the left, blood. <laughs> Real shit. Real shit, bro. You get me? I'm still like confident we can like mm. keep up what we're doing. But I'm 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 pissed today. I'm disappointed. Shop for AFTV merch at shop.aftv.co.uk. Subscribe to us on YouTube. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat, and Twitch. We've got content for every platform, so check it out.